All right, it's been a while since I made a video. I figured I will show some updates with my blue car. Currently installing Holly. Runs up to there. Nice mounting bracket I use rib nuts on. Some of the wiring for the wide bands. Power wire for the Holly runs back here. Gotta add a couple zip ties over this guy. Goes into the trunk. Boom. Got the diff brace in here, their new one. East Coast drive shaft, East Coast drive line drive shaft in here. We got the Speed Logics deal, which I've had for a minute. We got Cook's headers, dumps that I made. So this is a track thing. My ex full exhaust is going back on in about a week. Um, PPE extended capacity transpan. I have a stage two and a half transmission from um, sorry, I got a call. I got a uh, a two and a half transmission from uh, ATS. It's Applied Torque Solutions. Brian over there. I got a billet E and a billet C hub and a lot of clutches. Added in everywhere. A modified P2. It's been welded and modified. Um, currently have, if you follow Modern Red Hemi, I have the Modern Red Headache version 2 cam, which is the same as his, in the car currently. Um... Oh, the, I think I said the Cook's headers. Um, it dynoed 525 on our new dyno. Um, for reference, we just ran a stock 2017 392 Daytona, and it put down um, 412, 415, and 413. When we get to the top, I'll show the top, but this is where we're at right now. All right. So this is my factory ECU here, and then this is the gateway. So this plugs into the car and then this plugs into this harness over here. That came up through the uh, side there. And then um, we got the wideband stuff which I already showed you. We got coil drivers down here. And then the factory harness stuff. Let me see if I can pull you up a coil driver here. So. I'm gonna figure out how to tuck and zip tie and clean up all this stuff. And then you see where this is running through. I'm gonna run the data cable through that. So this will come up through the firewall and that's how we'll tune the thing. So the other additions I've made, this is actually 3D printed here. And this is a, uh, a test piece JLT is going to release soon. I work with him to make this for the Hellcat throttle body with the adapter for these cars, so that'll be available soon. And I think that's pretty much it. I'm going to finish this up and see how she sounds. All right, I got the gateway plugged in. I gotta back this thing up a little bit so I can pull the data cable through. I need to have the door wide open. And if she starts up and everything works, I can finish it up. And before someone asks, orange runs right there. I got about 90% of the parts. It'll be alive soon. <laughs> That's all I can say. That's a March thing, is the plan. So, all right, let's try and Start this thing up. Let me see if my key's in here. Doesn't look like it. And this may not run good because it's on like a bass tune type thing.
it. So this is what everything looks like buttoned up, literally just like stock. It uses all the stock harness and everything except for the wide band and the exhaust. So I'm gonna give all these people shout outs. But anyway, I'll try and upload more soon.